14. I got my first order. I'm all the way in Katy, and it is at this uh, it's called Fantastic uh, I don't know, Fantastic Folk, something like that. But I decided I'm in a good mood today. You want to know why I'm in a good mood? Because I'm looking cute. I got the romper on, I got the nose piercing on, I got the earrings on, I got the hair did up. You feel me? You feel me? Okay, you don't feel me? That's cool. That's cool. We're gonna get this bread anyway. So. Order is secured. I'm on my way. They're 7.9 miles away. Let's get this money, baby. Second order, we out here. Taco Bell in the drive through line. Making my way. The way, y'all, this order is worth $6. $6. Let y'all in on a little secret, a little trick that I do to keep myself out on the road and like not taking any real breaks. This is what I do. Whenever I'm picking up certain orders and I'm starting to feel hungry, I'll order myself something on the side while I'm picking the order up. Then, it's like, once I get that, I eat and drive. So I'm, I'm not recommending that you eat and drive, okay? I'm not condoning that, because it's not safe. But what I will do is like, when I'm done dropping off their order, I'll park real quick, eat my food, and then I'll keep the app on, and then while I'm getting orders, you know, I'll finish, hurry up and finish my food and get the food. So that's how I do it, I just keep it moving. I like to keep it moving. I got my food and their food, see? We all good. Everybody wins, everybody wins. Now this particular order, they're 8.8 .8 miles away, 19 minutes. So you know that tip is gonna hit. I ain't even got a questioning. Gang, I'm on my fourth order now. I'm starting off a little shaky today. It's 1.30. Only on my fourth order. What's going on? You know what's going on? But we gonna see y'all cause y'all know how, how nighttime it picks up. So I'm not really worried about it. And it is a Friday. This mask about to piss me off y'all. I ain't even gonna lie. Look at this, look at this. I'm about to eat the mask. I'm about to eat the mask. Let's get this bread. Oh, we are at the catfish station. I don't want to keep recording because they're going to look at me crazy. Order! Bahama Bucks, y'all. Like, this customer ordered the right thing, y'all. That looks so good. Like, don't that just look good? I might have to take a trip to Bahama Bucks after this. I'm telling you, because that is it, it, tempting. Here's the update. I'm halfway to my regular goal, like my daily, you know, $100. But to hit my super goal, I need to push it a little bit harder. I need to go to the area that's popping because right now it's kind of slow. I've only done seven trips. And I need to get a little bit more bread in my pockets before I go home, obviously. So it's 424 right now. Okay. And I'm in between I'm hungry and I don't want to stop grinding until I hit $100. So it's kind of a hard spot that I'm in right now. Because getting food would take time off the clock where I could be getting orders getting paid you feel me but at the same time i gotta eat i gotta eat because if i don't eat i'm not gonna be able to drive i'm not gonna be able to survive I'm smelling all that good food i'm not gonna be able to survive i might just i might just pick up somebody's fry i'm not saying i would do it but i might okay i'm back i had a, a dinner break with the fam you feel me but i'm back out here it's 7 p.m we starting good y'all this order just popped up it's a double order first of all it's a double order and it's worth 14 dollars. so let's go it's crazy but I'm actually waiting in line for the second order because the first one I got from a different restaurant. I got it from Las Manadas and now I'm at now I'm at Slosh Peas, y'all. That's crazy. So it told me to pick that one up first. And now I'm picking up the second one at this drive-in. So like two different restaurants. And y'all, and get this, get this. This is the crazy part. Both people have the same name, y'all. I'm picking up two Jessicas, y'all. This this person's name is Jessica. The person that I'm picking up his name is Jessica. The only way I can tell the difference, y'all, between these two names is their last name. One of them has an F and one of them has a B. So I just have to remember which one had uh this food and which one had that food. Oh my god. Go. They're taking a really long time, y'all, and I'm just like, hurry up, because I got somebody else's food sitting here, and I don't want their food to get cold. But at the same time, I'm trying to pick up their food. But I don't want this person to wonder where their food is at and why it's taking so long. But at the same time, this person probably like, why is this food taking? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh, babe. Uber got me in the country. Uh, Y'all, don't judge my windshield, okay? I know it needs to be clean. Don't judge me, okay? I'm worried about this bread. We can do all that later. See, I have no idea where I'm at. I just know it's a lot of trees and there's a gas 
gas station like every five miles or so, y'all. But at least it's still daytime out. Once it gets to like 8.30, I'm getting out of this area, for real. Oh my God, I feel like I'm on a roller coaster in my car. Look at these hills, y'all. Look how, look how steep this is. Look how steep this is, yo. This is like unbelievably kind of scary, but cool at the same time. Like, yo, I'm out here, out here. Getting this bread, though. I'm on my 12 order. Oh my God, look, this is so beautiful. Slots, kids. It makes it look good. <laughs> Not showing my license plate, but I'm really out here. <laughs> Y'all, I got my 13th order. I'm out of the country, thank God, because I did not like being out in that area, y'all. I started to get creeped out. We go start seeing like a bunch of like Trump flags and Trump signs and Trump everything. And I was like, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. And then there was like this truck, y'all, this truck, and I felt like it was following me. Like it was going back on the back roads with me for a while. I got freaked out, y'all. I was like, okay. This is too much. Like, my heart was beating fast and everything. That's why I was like, nope. If it ever says Magnolia, nope. Decline. I don't care how much money it is. Decline. Because I don't need to feel scared like that. And it's scary times. Especially nowadays. I don't need to be feeling scared like that. So, uh-uh. I'm not playing with that. Got this uh, Japanese steakhouse. Bougie, bougie. <laughs> Y'all, they handed me a bag a hole in it the bag had a hole in the bottom and the juice was coming out so i was, I was walking to my car i was like uh, uh i came back to the store and i was like um this has a hole in it i can't deliver it like this like for real i'm not about to play with nobody my car has had spilled drinks in there before and slushies and like other stuff so mm -mm, i'm not having nobody else's food or drink spilled in my stuff today uh, uh so they give me a fresh bag and let's go so i'm on my 15th trip and I surpassed my hundred dollar goal already. I had to close my door because people were walking. But I surpassed my hundred dollar goal. Look at where I'm at. Look where I'm at. Look where I'm at. And I don't know if I'm gonna make two hundred today. But if I make one fifty, I'm gonna be happy. If I make one fifty, I'm gonna be good. Cause this order is worth nine dollars, y'all. Let me hurry up. Let me hurry up and go get it. Let me hurry up. And I took my hair out. I I took my hair down because that hair tie was giving me a headache, y'all. It just when I wear hair ties for too long, I get headaches. I can't do it all day. Y'all, I'm determined to hit my $150 goal today, okay? And so close. I'm on my 17th order. It is 10 45 p.m. I'm out here late, but I'm out here. Hi, I have an Uber pickup. Um, Y'all, I cut it off because I forgot the code number. <laughs> I'd be scared when they ask for the code number because they usually just be like, okay, just pull up. Okay, y'all, so the goal tonight, since I'm already out here, I only got two hours of drive time left, really, so I want to try and hit at least two more trips after this one and then call it a day, two more. If I can get in two more trips, I think I'm going to be good. Y'all, I'm on my 19th trip, and it's really late now. Like, it's like 11.30. It's about to be midnight. I can't believe I'm here. But hurry up. Let me get my mask. Let me get my mask back here. Thank you. Y'all see the time? I'm still out here. I'm still out here. This is my last trip though, for real. Like, it's way too late. I'm way past the time. But it's midnight, y'all, and I'm still out here. I'm at, um, I'm at IHOP. What's up, Indian Nation? So I'm back home, you guys. I made it home. And I have to talk quiet because people are asleep and it's like one in the morning right now. But y'all, 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 look how much you made. Look how much you made in one day. That's crazy. 174. I almost made 200. But I do 20 trips, y'all. And I work till midnight. Like, that's crazy. Like, literally, between today and yesterday, I made up for the whole week's earnings, really. Like, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, them days I was slacking, y'all. I made up for it in two days. I almost flipped four hundred dollars in two days. That's crazy. Tell me that ain't crazy. If, like I said, if that don't motivate you to hustle, I don't know what to tell you. I don't know what to tell you. But I'm about to go to bed, y'all. As you can see, I'm already prepared to go to bed. Okay, I got my bonnet on and everything, my little nightgown dress, everything. But I love you guys so much. Make sure you tell your friends to tune in because we are out here hustling, okay? We're making bread in our cars. Tell a friend. Tell them to tune in. Anyway.
anyways i love you guys so much i'll see you on the next driving video bye